Good morning, Libra. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing good. Welcome aboard the Cosmic Chariot. I'm going to be your tarot reader today. My name is Tyler. How are you guys doing? All right, so this is going to be your career reading, Libra. Not all messages will resonate, but take what resonates and leave the rest behind. For that being said, let's do two more shuffles. Two more shuffles for Libra. So moon, Venus, and Rising Sun. All right. All right. <laughs> okay, Libra. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so already it already looks like a good reading. At the bottom of the deck, you have the Two of Wands. You have the Four of Swords, the Four of Wands, the Three of Pentacles, the King of Cups, and the Wheel of Fortune. So you could be waiting around uh, trying to make a decision. You're, you're contemplating making a decision because you're not really sure how to move forward or um, if this person is good for you right or if maybe it's a job opportunity that you're just like well this decision i would is very open like it seems like we could have a really good relationship and then this one is like freedom there's no contract holding me back or this could be an old job where uh, you can't leave until um until this contract is up so you gotta really make a decision on whether you want to renew your contract or end your contract, whatever it is. Um, but the Wheel of Fortune is in the upright. So it does look good for you, whichever you choose. Um, I'm not going to tell you which one to choose, but the Four of Wands is more of a open uh, relationship. Like they're willing to have a good relationship with you and work on some things. And yeah, this uh, the boss could be a king of cups, or that could be your energy. Maybe you like to use... <sighs> so, instead of, like, putting all your emotions out there so this uh, the worker knows what's going on with you, you're kind of, like, you're putting up a front, right? You're kind of, like, you're saying this, that, and that, and it's looking really good, but you're not saying what, how you're feeling in the back of your mind. So, um... Yeah, you're definitely, you have a decision to make when it comes to your workplace and what you want to do for work, but this could also be a relationship, uh, relationship-wise, whatever the decision is for you, I'm basing it off a of career, but it can be a relationship, all right? So let's, uh, let's clarify this four of wands, so... You could be dealing with a Cancer, you don't have to be, or a Pisces, Scorpio, just water sign in general. Um, you have some air signs, uh, some fire signs, and some earth signs. So all the signs are here. Um, you have like one of every card, and then the Wheel of Fortune, which is good luck, good fortune. Uh, whatever it is that you choose is going to work out for the best. So just make a wise decision and do what's best for you. All right, so we're going to clarify the Four of Wands. Let's clarify the Four of Wands. I just saw the Sun's card, so it looks like it could be a new start. You have the Ace of Cups. So, yeah, this Four of Wands is definitely emotionally fulfilling for you. Maybe your other job just wasn't the best for you. It just it kind of lacked some strengths. It didn't give you any benefits. And then this new job is very beneficial, and it's in... Uh, it gives you a raise, basically. Like, they're giving you more money, more offers, and, you know, more benefits uh, that are really helping you. And at the bottom of the deck, you have the Sun card. Okay, so definitely looks like, um, or this could just be, like, you contemplating, like, going back to an old job because maybe you had better benefits there. And if you go back there, it would be, like, a new start. Because you didn't, you left off, you left the place in a good manner. Like you didn't leave on a bad note or anything. You kind of just left because you felt like you had a better offer elsewhere. Um, but it's really how you resonate with the message. Okay, let's get into your advice cards. 
But that four of wands, whatever that decision is that you need to make, it looks like that's your best opportunity. All right, but you're just waiting for this contract to end so you can make that decision, whatever contract it is. Uh, this could also be housing. So maybe uh, you're waiting until your lease is up and in order for you to move into a new home, all right? Or buying a new home that's, you know, better for you, all right? Maybe there's like a better school system over there and it may be a higher price, but it's just there's good neighbors. Um, you know, it's just very good over there. Like, I don't see anything wrong with that decision. It actually looks pretty good. All right, so for your advice, you have leadership, self-discipline, and psychic ability. So you could be a reader or... And you could also be, uh, you know, learning your um, learning discipline and how to really control yourself, not really like put yourself out there too much, kind of just like moving forward. But, you know, you don't want to put yourself all the way out there, right? So you want to, you know, you're basically putting up a front, but at the same time, you're just like, um, I'm not going to put all of my emotions into this person or into this job. Just I'm waiting until I make an offer or you're waiting on someone else to make an offer. Um, maybe, you know, someone sees your potential and they're just like, um, should I go for it? Should I not? Um, should I accept this person? Should I not? Like that's what's kind of going through your head or their head and, because, you know, you would like a reader in your, you know, facility if you have a place that, um, you know, that, you know, has readers in it. <laughs> um, and that can be palm readers, uh, tar tarot readers, like I'm doing now. Um, and then you got self-discipline and leadership here. For your other card, you have good fortune mystery void and grace so again with that good fortune it does look good it looks like it's going to work well for you whatever it is um i feel like if you're going for an offer they're going to accept you the one that's mostly beneficial for you and if you're like trying to decide go for the one that has a better that you have a better relationship with like that um because it's going to show your leadership skills and how like um, good you are at like it's just going to really pr prompt your skills. It's and it's going to be very beneficial for you. All right. So Libra, I hope you guys resonate with this video. If you did, please like, comment and subscribe. Namaste. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.